Good girl, yeah! Max Prairie Wings presents At The Line. All right, last week we covered Forrest Holder. Remember, we started with a leather glove and we taught the dog how to understand a little bit about pressure on their ear and we stuck a leather glove, our hand, in their mouth, all right? Just like this. Pressure on, fetch, open their mouth, good. Pressure off, okay? Not a lot of pressure, just a little bit. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold, hold, good, give. Now, Next step to forced hold, very simple. We're going to get rid of this and we're going to replace it with a bumper. Now, this is going to take a little work, more times than not, to get the dog to accept that bumper. Very simply, here's how we do it. Got our collar, flat buckle collar, ear right on the ridge of that collar. We take a bumper. It's going to take a little work and we're going to say, fetch, fetch. Pressure's off now. Good boy, good, very good. Very good. We're not getting him to reach. We're not getting him to follow. We're not getting him to move for the bumper. We're just working on forced hold, okay? This is purely so we can get a dog that will hold on to a bird, whether it's crippled, dead, whatever, and deliver the hand, okay? Good boy. Good boy. Good man. Good man. Give. Pressure's on. Not a lot of pressure. Just a little pressure on that ear. Fetch. Pressure's off. Hold it. Hold it. Now some, probably most, are going to have a difficult time getting that dog to hold that bumper in their mouth. Don't go crazy trying to tear their ear off or anything like that. Just get them to hold it. Hold it. Work it in there. Make sure their cheeks and their lips are all out of the way so it's not uncomfortable. The dog should have their adult teeth. Nine, ten months is probably about as soon as you want to attack this. Some people may want to, if they're going to do a strict force fetch program, six, seven, eight months is okay. But if you're just looking for forced hold, just a hunting dog to deliver the hand, which is purely okay, you just want to, you just attack forced hold, nothing to it. So we're going through it, good, he's doing a great job, absolutely nothing to it. So we want to go over it, it's going to take three or four days, 10, 15 minutes, sometimes twice a day, okay? Give, pressure's on again, okay? I got pressure on his ear, it's uncomfortable, okay? Until he gets something in his mouth, it's going to be uncomfortable. Fetch, pressure's off, good boy. Very good. Now, let's say that everything goes just like it has right now. We're going to take a, a check cord, okay? I'm going to get it on here. Every check cord. And it's going to be very important that we have a small transition here. And that small transition is going to be him moving with this in his mouth. Now, it's his natural tendency, obviously, to pick that bird up and bring it back into your vicinity. But it can be difficult getting the dog to deliver the hand. So we're going to take it. We're going to walk him and heel a little bit. Heel, 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 heel. Good boy. Hold it. Hold it. Good. Hold. Good boy, Max. Good boy. Hold. Heel. Good man. Good. Very good. Here, here, here. Good. You're doing good, big fella. Doing good. You're doing good, big fella. Good, good. 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 Sit. Good boy, good boy, nice work. Hip, up, 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 up. Hey, hey, hey! Absolutely nothing to this. I'm telling you, if you'll take your time, give yourself at least a couple weeks, work through this, keep your temper in check, relax, everything will be okay, and you will lose very few birds in the field.